Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. In this video, I'm going to talk about what is custom annotation in Spring Framework and where exactly we can use it. I'll show you a picture so that you can understand. Uh, in this picture, you can see two services, booking service and billing service. And on top of this, we have three different annotations, but which is very similar. And it looks like these annotations are duplicated. So in this case, uh, if you if you in your real application, if you have ten services and in the ten services we are having the same annotations on top of all the classes, it will be a replic uh, it it will be a duplicate. So we should avoid the duplicate of annotations. Uh, according to uh, don't repeat try principle. Don't repeat yourself. Try principle. This it's a design principle. So in order to avoid duplication in your annotations we can have our custom annotation so for example 10 classes you want to have the same annotations what we can do is we can have our my service class and you can have the annotations in a single place and you can in turn use my service annotation at the other 10 classes 10 service classes okay so in this way we have all the annotations at one place so if you want to change you have to change at least in only one place not 10 places so in this case we are doing a we are applying don't repeat yourself principle design principle so I have my booking service here and I have my billing service here so I don't want to have duplicate annotations here so I have my own custom annotation created okay so if you see here in only one place I have all these annotations if I want to change I will change here not in all the service classes so in this way I'm able to achieve in this way I'm able to avoid duplicate of annotations so this is the uh, uh, usage of custom annotation and one more point is for a custom annotation you have to give at interface and this is so this tells the Java it's a custom annotation this interface tells Java this is a custom annotation. Okay. Hope this video is useful. Thank you and all the best.